Hello Canada, my name is Aset and I am the Vice Minister of Foreign Affairs of the Czech Republic of Echkeria. I am very pleased to announce that the next Forum of Free Nations of Post-Russia will be held in the Canadian Parliament on November 19 in Ottawa. During this event, the representatives of colonized nations will speak about the transformation of Russia. The Forum of Free Nations of Post-Russia is a platform that unites colonized nations leading uh, the anti-colonial and national liberation struggle against Russian imperialism. We believe that the so-called Russian Federation should be transformed into a peaceful and uh, civilized post-Russian space which will ensure security in Europe and around the world. What can the decolonization of Russia bring to Canada? It is in Canada's interest to have democratic allies overseas which will ensure peace and stability and security. By having a democratic Eastern Europe, Canada will be better able to protect its sovereignty and democracy. Canada's remote geography is no longer an obstacle for Russia and Canada could become a target from the north if the Russian Empire's ambitions continue to grow. Russia can transform into a true democracy only if it abandons its imperialist ambitions. As long as Russia exists as an empire, it will continue to expand its borders through imperial wars. Russia fought in Chechnya, in Georgia, in Syria, and now is trying to destroy Ukraine. Because Russia systematically undermines international security, Canada and its allies are forced to spend significant resources on uh, defense and on military aid. Geopolitical threats caused by the so-called Russian Federation affect all of us as we're all paying the price. Recognizing the right to self-determination for captive nations can accelerate the democratization of, of Russia. Captive nations are part of the solution and I believe it's time to listen to them. Please join us at the Canadian Parliament on November 19. See you in Ottawa. Thank you.